All right, guys, it is Monday, day one of the new training cycle. This is the BSG RX double session um, explanation video. So uh, session one, which a lot of us are gonna be um, not used to doing double sessions where both of them are involving some weight. So we're gonna kind of ease into it. Um, so session one is actually our weightlifting session for the day. We're gonna swap back and forth on one AM session, PM session on which one's the CrossFit, which one's cardio or gas tank, and which one's that actual weightlifting session. So session one today, front front uh, front squat to a one rep max. We've been doing some front squatting leading up to, to leading up to today, but it's been mostly positional focus. So um, if a big lift is in the card, cool. If not, hit something decent, move on. This is going to be a marker that we use moving forward because we're going to be doing doing a lot of single leg work on this path. So um, we're going to test retest in about eight weeks on this front squat. Moving into um, some strength endurance work, six sets of one squat clean at 70 to 85% of your one rep max with about 90 seconds rest between sets. And then finishing up the AM session with a 24 minute EMOM, five, five alternating minutes and then one minute worth of rest um, of all single leg stuff and then some band and glute ham raises. Get the work done. The uh, Bulgarian split squats should be with a dumbbell. The ATG squats should be with the dumbbell, probably a little bit lighter than what the uh, Bulgarian split squats are gonna be, but you guys can kind of play it by feel. On the ATG split squats, it's really important that you guys are pushing the knee well over the toe because we're trying to get to the VMO with this. So don't worry so much about being like heel-based on the ATG squats. We're trying to go to um, knees, knees forward on the toes which is why it can be a little bit lighter just because it's an awkward position that most of us are not going to be used to. Um, going into session number two for Monday, uh, this is the class workout. So those of you guys that want to jump into class and do it with the group, you'll be able to take advantage of that. It's three short four-minute AMRAP separated by four minutes worth of rest, power snatch, bar muscle up, four-minute rest, power clean, chest to bar, four-minute rest, deadlift, toe to bar, and then we'll move on. This is also going to be a test retest that we do. Come out hot on this. Um, unless you're somebody that has some serious bar muscle up or chest to bar or toe to bar endurance issues, everybody should be coming out at about 95% pace, especially on, um, on the barbell. Barbell should be unbroken. Limit your chalk breaks. We should not be, I'd say we should maybe be chalking once, maybe twice per each four minute AMRAP. So try to hold yourself consistent with that. In workouts like this, these are this is a good example of a workout where just about everybody is gonna be able to go unbroken for a pretty long period of time relative to the work, which is only four minutes. So the only way that you're gonna be able to make up time is by tightening up your transition. So try to be mindful of that. 